New at four shockwaves in Germany after a deadly mass shooting at a Jehovah's Witness Center. It happened last night in Hamburg. Seven people, including the shooter, died. Several other people were injured. As CBS 2's Tina Kraus tells us, police say the gunman was no stranger to the congregation. Forensic investigators collected evidence at the scene the morning after a gunman opened fire at his former Jehovah's Witnesses congregation in Hamburg. Authorities are still searching for a motive in the attack that left six people dead before the gunman apparently took his own life. A woman who was 28 weeks pregnant lost her unborn baby. She was among eight wounded in the rampage that shocked Germany, where mass shootings are rare. Officers reached the prayer hall as the attack was unfolding. This man who took video of the scene with his phone says he heard at least two dozen gunshots before a long pause and then one more. A police unit specially trained to deal with rampages and terror attacks were among the first on the scene. Officials said they likely prevented more casualties. Authorities say the suspected gunman was a 35-year-old German national identified only as Philip F. in accordance with rules for naming suspects. Police said he had left the congregation voluntarily, but apparently not on good terms about a year and a half ago. Tina Kraus, CBS News. Police say there's no indication this was a terrorist attack. They say the suspected gunman had a weapons license and legally owned a semi-automatic pistol.